Eleanor Roosevelt says, do something every day that scares you. This is what scares me. So we just arrived in elementary school, to which we are going to go classroom to classroom and... And evangelize! Tell them about Jesus! Yay! Ah! Hey. <laughs> Alright, Kara, you ready? Yeah. Are you? No. We got this. Hi, everybody. My name is Caleb, and this is... And we are from America. Where are we going next? Uh, to another classroom. One down. One down. Oh, hi, hi. How's it going? Good morning, everybody. Good morning. You guys are awesome. Okay, two down. Two more to go. Two more to go. So in typical month four fashion, everything has been switched on us, so we don't know what's going on. We're being swarmed by little people. Yeah. Okay. They've gathered all of the fifth and sixth graders together. I think they're gathering the entire school as they're watching me from right here. Maybe we're gonna just get here because we are two women and only thing for us. Okay. All right. Yeah, we'll start. Okay. I'm gonna do something I've never done before. I'm gonna preach in front of a thousand little kids. To be honest, I've never preached before at all. So I hope, hopefully, they're a good audience. I'm really nervous. So first things first is we would like to sing a couple of songs. So if we could all stand up. something later today to which I volunteered myself to do. I don't know what I'm doing. So it's later now and I'm in the back of this truck? Maybe? I don't know. So we are about to go to a state college campus and give a little presentation. We have an hour and a half to give and I have volunteered myself to preach slash speak. I want to tell you I'm incredibly nervous at this point in time. Being over the last couple of weeks, I had to rethink my my gospel. What I believe Jesus to do and who I believe Jesus to be and what I believe the kingdom of God looks like. I've had to rethink all of that. And here I am about to give it to a bunch of kids. Well, college kids. But you get my point. Ah! Eleanor Roosevelt says, do something every day that scares you. This is what scares me. They're talking about something. I don't know what. We were told for. We were told for a clock. But we have four thirty. Yeah. Oh, okay. So we have some news. I want to start. This is interesting. Caleb left us his camera, so <laughs> we're on his vlog now. We're uh, on the vlog. <laughs> Yeah, our game plan just changed. This has been a recurring theme for us this month. Yeah. A lot of late minute, last minute changes. All the time. 
It happens, you know, YOLO. It's the world race is what we do. No biggie, we got this. But uh, Caleb's gonna preach. He's gonna bring down the house. It's gonna be bomb. He's nervous. Aw, poor Caleb. He's never, I don't, I I don't know if he'll I'm show nervous. it to the camera, but he's nervous. Aw, Caleb's nervous. <laughs> it's okay, because it's good. It's a good nervous, right? Oh yeah. He's not gonna yeah. put this in the vlog. <laughs> no, he's not, but it's cool. How are you feeling, Caleb? I'm really nervous. Yeah? But you know what? Sometimes you just gotta jump out of your comfort zone like this. Woo! <laughs> the first country we went to was Cambodia. And then we went to Thailand. And then after that we arrived at Malaysia. And now we're here in the Philippines. Woo -woo. Freya. Hi. How are you feeling I'm about this? Really so good. Thank you. I have a testimony that I'm gonna give. You I'm kind of nervous, but I know okay. God's gonna get involved. Oh. I hope so. I don't know how that went. Man, how would it go? Man, it went awesome. It went awesome. The Lord just... It went awesome. Yeah. Okay. Alright. Getting back in the van thing.